Hey Cougar fans, I'm Haley Oswald here with another Cougar Spotlight. This week we spoke with Cougar couple Spencer and Mallory Wardell. So let's take a look. So 2009 yeah. is when we first met. I had just moved from Arizona and so I was planning on living with my grandma and it was like my first day at church and I met him and he was singing on the worship team, so I was a little impressed. Because <laughs> <laughs> we were both at Spokane Falls Community College. And um, he Facebook messaged me <laughs> and he was uh, telling me all these things about I was pretty and his, like the pictures and yeah, it was funny. And then he's like, and just in case you need my number, here it is. And right. I was like, oh, okay, yeah. just in case. Yeah. <laughs> just in case. <laughs> message me. Uh, yeah. Text me. <laughs> On my 21st birthday, he surprised me at the restaurant that I worked. Um, and it was really funny because I was supposed to work on my birthday and he kept on telling me like, I'm gonna talk to your manager and make sure you don't work. And I was like, it's fine, it's not that big of a deal. And he's like, no, it's a big deal. I'm like, okay. And then the night of it, he, I didn't really think he would. And then I didn't think that he had the money. And so when I was reading the engagement letter to, like, and him proposing to me basically, I thought he was gonna propose to me with a ring pop. But I realized it was an actual read. <laughs> when he opened, I was like, oh, he's, it's really going to happen. Yeah. So it was exciting. So that's, that's when we got engaged, was on her 21st yeah. birthday. Yeah. And then it was just a matter of time. We set the date for July 7th. 7-7. Seven, seven. It's yeah, an easy seven, day to seven. remember. Really easy to remember. <laughs> Most of the time, our real actual time spent together is eating dinner. And that's about all the real time we get together. <laughs> and then, of course, you get the, you know, the traveling schedules, because rowing and track are completely different. and so. Sometimes I'll be traveling, she'll be here, or she'll be traveling, I'll be here, and so we get to see each other less, and so it seems like there's not enough time in the day. <laughs> we keep kind of counting down the days till we get to graduate, and yeah, we're like, okay, we only so have close. a few more weeks, <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> we both are in the social sciences. Um, next week, on Tuesday, I'm taking the written exam for the Spokane Police Department. Yeah, I also am social sciences, and I actually have like technically an internship this summer with Nabisco, who my future is. I don't really know, <laughs> which yeah. is okay. Like I, I, I don't know. I'm okay with that. We're kind of. This is almost like our. This is we're trying to almost start a normal life. Yeah. You know, <laughs> um, what does that look like? We have no idea. You know, the newlyweds. The only thing we know is busy, busy, busy. You're traveling. I'm traveling. You have practice. You know, all that stuff. So, trying to find out what that looks like and. Um, kind of ex more or less just kind of like exploring and seeing like how everything's going to work out because it's I mean everything is pretty much a giant question mark. Coming out of high school I thought you know I, I really wanted to come to WSU that's what I wanted and um, but they didn't recruit me um, and there was no scholarship money available and it was really expensive so what I ended up doing is going to community college and so that's when I started getting actually recruited from WSU with Coach Sloan. Um, and so he started recruiting me for the decathlon when I was at the community college. And um, I was really excited about that. And so coming here was a really big deal. And it and has been an incredible experience. I've been here, this is my third year here, and uh, I have thoroughly enjoyed it. You know, the hard training workouts in the fall and, you know, doing repeat training, throwing up on the side of the track, and all that fun stuff. I mean, uh, it's, it's gonna be weird for me, um, just because track and field has been such a big part of my life. And the biggest thing that I've noticed with the rowing team is that it's not an individual sport at all. And it's like such a connection because we're a boat and you can't just have the sport all about you because you have to be connected with the boat. And the biggest thing that they emphasize is family. And I love that about it because no matter what, even if there's disagreements or um, frustrations, everyone on the team still will do anything for anyone. And it's like such a family unit. And I love that. I'm Spencer Wardell. I'm Mallory Wardell. And thank you for watching Cougar Spotlight. Go, Go Cougs! Cougs.